homework. The only other problem is, once Chocolatito hits the own button, can you withstand all of the offense? McWilliams and Royal having a nice round against Chocolatito. He's having a good round now, uh, Max, but the only problem we have to see is we know Gonzalez begin building the tempo and adding to the combinations that he's already throwing, a pattern that we've seen. Working him with that left hand so far in this round. I mean, Chocolatito also doing nice work, and the first round was competitive and close, which is, by all standards, a, a good round to have against Chocolatito. But... McWilliams in this round, now Chocolatito's getting going, but throws an average of about 85 or 90 punches per round. And as we've mentioned before, 30 landed power shots per round on average. Number one among all top fighters counted by CompuBox. Here he goes. Combinations landing now. And he's such a kind of uh, experience while it's happening. Chocolatito has been in this situation several times before. Arroyo has it, man. That, that doesn't mean he can't rise to the top here, but he just has not been in this situation. Hard left hook ahead. in the first minute of this round. And an even better hook by Chocolatito. Yeah, Chocolatito, even as he absorbed lands and the effect it seems to have, even psychologically on the opponent, the discouraged look an opponent who's doing good work tends to get. Like that right hand right there. That right hand hurt Oreo. Ten seconds left in the round. Chocolatito. I mean, this is best you can expect against a guy like Chocolatito. Seems to be headed toward a rally. Good and Chocolatito right comes back with something hard. He wants a little reprieve, and Chocolatito won't give it to him. Arroyo's yeah. gesturing toward the sole of the shoe. Okay. I'm stepping backwards, and as he stepped back, there the shoe sole came right off at the foot then. It, was, it had come loose earlier, and as he went back to the right side, it finally came out from under the shoe, and then it finally detaches. Throw those punches at the body, at the top and at the body, all right? Landed Arroyo 72 to 29. I don't believe they were able to replace the sole. So now Arroyo is simply fighting with a soleless shoe on the right foot. They retied it. I don't know what protocol is here. Um, Harold, is there any kind of rule or protocol related to faulty equipment during a fight? No, Jim, absolutely not. I think that's, you know, that's the, the foot he has to pivot. What can do in the war, the war doesn't stop. And CompuBox numbers from this round would seem to suggest that at the very least, Arroyo's concentration is being bothered somewhat. Any punches in that attack, that you can never tell which one is coming to kill you. Vicious body shot left took to the belly by Gonzalez. Straight right hand. Left hook just under the right elbow. Usually when flyweights throw the hook to the body, it doesn't sound like a bass drum. <laughs> Not but, at all. But it does when Chocolatito. And like almost like a jab to just touch him. And then the thumping left hook to the body. And McWilliams and is fighting a really good fight. Doing some really good punches here. Showing some real good stamina himself. Six. Look at you. I got it 59, 55, five rounds to one. Chocolatito Gonzalez. Jimmy's been putting on a show like this since the second round. When he lands, Arroyo. Hard left to the body by Gonzalez. Arroyo still active, still throwing a lot of punches. Ready for the body shot, and that's how he hurt it. But he's doing the opposite to McWilliams. A display of beautiful body shots. Left to the body right there, followed by the right uppercut right here. Another left to the liver shot. Wonderful punches, right hand straight down the pipe to the body. Then come right back to that level again with a left body shot. You've seen the last couple rounds, what makes Chocolatito so uh, effective. Pretty good at ducking and slipping, too. Yes, he is. Good That's work. a big left hook. Throw and throw. Yeah. It's an it's avalanche. To land. Hard right hand landed for Gonzalez. <laughs> and it's getting more and more difficult oh. for Arroyo. Lexus Arguello teaching him how to fight. Way better than money could ever buy him. The great Alexis Arguello. Well, you gotta give McWilliams some credit. This kid came to fight. Taking who we can get. Here you see these guys trade left hook with Chacatito overthrown with a forward motion, and you see the legs wobble. And this is on a night when Arroyo, by all of our lights, has been fighting very well. Just can't seem to win rounds against the relentless Chocolatito Gonzalez. And relentless is... 82, Chocolatito Gonzalez. Jim, 
the effectiveness, the uh, the right hand, uh, you know, he just stays on top of him and lands and lands and lands. Williams Arroyo and Arroyo's not returning in kind. Straight right hand by Gonzalez upstairs, left to the body, another left to the body, yeah. just another straight right hand, the same focused attack, the same intensity. There's only one Chocolatita Gonzalez at this particular moment in boxing. Good right hand by Chocolatito. After the good body work. Oh, good hook by McWilliams. Nick Williams Arroyo. Yeah. Set yeah. up by a hard left to the body by Gonzalez. Right there, Chocolatito caught the right thigh of McWilliams Arroyo. Now he gets the liver, what he was looking for. Oh, now it's there's a good beautiful. liver shot and landing more than 300. So the global leader in CompuBox offensive output will probably continue in that position after this fight. Well, of course he will. And a left hook upstairs for Roman Chocolatito Gonzalez. See if he can pull off the 12th round knockout, which is rare in boxing. Discipline tonight by McWilliams Arroyo coming in here after a layoff of more than a year. Says he stayed in the gym and stayed in shape, and he's shown it here with a steady, controlled, excellent performance over the course of 12 rounds against a guy who's simply more active, throwing more combinations. And Arroyo landed two good hook, but then Chocolatito comes right back with a beautiful right hand. Yeah, Arroyo's trying to land a home run hook to the head. Less than a minute to go. <laughs> well, he's, he, get, he gets to learn a little bit, though, uh, Max. Well, fighters see what they want to see. My guess is that Brother McJoe is going to walk out of here and say, aha, all his weaknesses. You know, my, my brother didn't get him, but I certainly will. That's the way fighters think. If I were them, I'd gang up. I don't know if one-on-one -on -one the flyweight's going to beat this guy. No, but McWilliams Arroyo is going to go the distance and stop Chocolatito Gonzalez's 10 knockout streak. And he has that in itself is an accomplishment. Roman Chocolatito.